Something that's neat about this game is the skip level button. It, you could totally skip a level if you're having way too much uh, difficulty with solving the puzzle. And we also have trophies, so we got a trophy for, uh, you know, solving the tutorial. A trophy for murdering somebody while he sleeps. That, that seems like a grim trophy. Let's see what these other trophies are for. Oh, it doesn't look like we can interact with any of them, but one looks like it's money. I'm guessing another is beating the game. I don't know. In any case, we're, we're uh, going to be solving this puzzle. So this is a, a complicated puzzle. I, I had to uh, basically restart this puzzle at least ten times uh, the first time I played this game. So, let's see. We've got a couple of elements here. Uh, number one, we can uh, melt the ice to get water. We can use this water on the tree in order to get an apple. And we can use the apple on the crow, as always, for a key. Okay, so we want to use the key here. That gives us a bell. Bell gives us a cat, and I presume we use the cat on the mouse. Okay, I've got some of these puzzles solved. I think I'm going to use the rain cloud to melt to, to uh, on the fire, right? It's not going to melt the fire, but it's going to do something to the fire. Oh, and then our hero just runs forward now. Okay. So now I've got a question. What do I do? I think I click on the owl to make it nighttime. Yeah, that makes it nighttime. And that gives us an axe. Okay, so I use the axe on the tree, right? No, not the owl, the tree! Let's try that again. Oh, and now it's not nighttime. Okay, make it nighttime. axe. Use it on the tree, but not the owl. Okay, this gives me a plank so I can build a bridge here. And now I make it daytime by clicking on the rooster. I click on the sun to dry up this cardboard, right? Hooray! Okay, so that is a two-minute puzzle. Yeah. Yeah kind of difficult. Oh, hey, and here's the princess. Mm, but there's the evil werewolf. Hmm, okay, so we've got a lot we can do here. I imagine we're going to have to drop the sun in order to uh, pull the moon up there. In order to drop the sun, we're going to have to do a whole lot. Let's see, can I move the cow? Okay, I'm going to need to get rid of this fire, so I'm going to drop the water here. That gives me a coin. I think I'm going to free the cow first. Use the cow to kill this enemy. Oh, and that creates a hole. Okay, so that creates a hole so I can drop the saw. Oh! That turns him into a werewolf and murders the... Yeah, okay, the werewolf murders the princess when I do that. Bad idea. Let me get that, that, that clue coin, though. Okay, so what you're supposed to do is actually water this bush. For flowers, and you give the flowers to the princess. She thinks it's cute. And goes inside where the werewolf follows her. Okay, all right, all right. So now I'm gonna drop the sun, maybe? Yeah, 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 so the princess is inside this time when the werewolf goes on a wild rampage. <laughs> the cow was asleep, that is so cute. Okay, so do I use this on the werewolf? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Gives me the key to the house. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think that was the princess's voice. Okay, so now what do I do? I drop the sun. 
I need something to give myself passage. Is there like a tree? There is a tree here. Okay, so I use this axe on the tree. I use this on the hole. And now our hero can safely reach the princess! Ari can walk on past her and ignore her completely. Yeah, that works too. That works too. Okay, and we got an achievement. Okay, you saw it in the lower right corner, right? Princess achievement. We saved the princess. Okay, so we're finished with campaign number two. After defeating the werewolf harvester, our knight safely returned the princess to her father. The princess was free once more. Her life could resume its natural course. And oh my gosh, look at all that laundry. Poor, poor princess. <laughs> okay, in the next video we'll start uh, campaign number three, King Napping.